Me and the boys have been dancing our whole lives, a good 15 years before Got Talent. Um, and Got Talent, you know, gave, gave us the platform, just like, you know, Got To Dance has for other loads of dancers, you know. Got Talent gave me and the boys a platform and we, um, we got out there. Well, until winning happened, I'm talking until the second it happened, there wasn't a, um, a thought in our minds that we were going to win with the whole Susan Ball phenomenon, you know. Um, we just thought, we came second, that's great. But when we won, all of a sudden the world blew up. We were in front of hundreds of people who wanted to interview us, thousands, hundreds of thousands of people in the street. We sold out tours all over the country. And it happened literally within a week. So um, we didn't really know what was going to happen, to be honest. Got to dance, just, it's hard to explain. It just kind of fell into my life and it happened so fast. I was judging within about three months of um, winning Got Talent. And um, yeah, I suppose, you know, Princess came to me, Princess Productions came to me and we were, they were talking to me and um, they said to me about the show and what I want to judge. And at the time, I, I'd just finished being a contestant. So I was like, judging was obviously really odd for me. So, but I was like, yeah, it sounds great. I love the whole ethos of the show. You know, it kind of seemed like a real show for dancers and I was really behind that. So I just jumped at the opportunity. It gets easier because I feel, you know, so many people have seen the show. The show is, you know, the show's everywhere now. And so I feel like people kind of know what to expect and the criticism is part of the, of the whole process. But at first, you know, dancers were coming on and I was looking at them really sympathetically. Like, you know, a matter of weeks ago, I was standing there. And so when they looked at me like this and I was like, no, it was really difficult at first, really difficult. But um, yeah, I still don't enjoy doing the red bit, but it's part of the process. That show is about more than just about dancing. It's about showing that people can achieve anything they want to if they put their mind to it. And dancing is one of those things that's super cool when it, if you do it well, it can look really difficult. But I just broke it down and said, I think I can teach anyone to dance. That was the strap line of the show. And um, I proved it in the series. You know, I've taught dinner ladies to policemen, to dentists, to in our new series, wheelchair basketball players. I mean, a whole variety of people. And um, it's been a really amazing experience, that show. This new show, um, Big Town Dance, is a completely different kettle of fish. I mean, it's still teaching people to dance, but that's where the similarities end. I mean, this was probably one of the most difficult, but one of the most rewarding experiences of my life. I mean, we moved up to a bit of a derelict town for two months, me and the rest of the Diversity Boys, and we just infiltrated it on every single level, taught everybody, brought the whole community together, which ended in like a 10,000 person strong dance routine. But when everyone came together, again, like Secret Street Crew, <clears throat> it was more than just about the dancing. The, the community really did come out and support each other. And it was, uh, it was a really special moment, actually. Definitely, television, is, for me, is a um, <clears throat> opportunity, put it that way. It's a way to reach people in the same way that Got Talent, Got To Dance has given me and other countless dancers opportunities. I think that I'd love to create opportunities and be a part of that and come at it from a dancer's point of view. And not just a dancer's point of view, but come at it from someone who believes that if you put your mind to it, you can do the impossible. I mean, we're a dance group. We're one of the only dance groups in the, on the entire planet that is doing what we're doing. And before it happened, everyone would have told us that you couldn't, but we have. And so that's the kind of thing I want to bring to telly. That's the kind of thing I want to show people.